Good evening. Again, I'm uh, Jeff Carroll, the Executive Assistant Chief here at the Metropolitan Police Department. I want to give a brief update um, related to the scene that we talked about early at 295 at Corals Eastern Avenue uh, northwest this afternoon. It's with a very heavy heart that I announced that uh, Investigator Wayne David, who is assigned to our Violent Crime Suppression Division, uh, did pass away this evening here at the hospital. Wayne was a, was a member of the Metropolitan Police Department for over 25 years, and he had been assigned to our Air Violent Crime Suppression Division, originally with their Gun Recovery Unit, and now with their Violent Crime Suppression Division since uh, 2007. He has recovered hundreds of guns across the city. He has been been the savior to, to, to many scenes, to many people in our community. He is known across the community. He's a resident here of the District of Columbia. Our hearts go out to him, his family, his daughter, his son, uh, his other family members, and his girlfriend also to the members of the Metropolitan Police Department. Wayne is a true hero to the District of Columbia to, to, and today he gave his life to serve the, the visitors and the residents here in the District of Columbia and we will never forget that. Uh, this is considered a line of duty death. Uh, obviously we will be having the appropriate honors to honor Wayne's legacy and what he provided here to the District of Columbia. Um, with that I'm not going to take any, any, uh, any questions uh, but I just want to provide you with an update with that. Thank you. All right, you just heard there from DC police just giving us heartbreaking news that officer there that accidentally shot himself, Wayne David, has, has passed away from his injuries. Yeah, certainly the news nobody wanted to hear tonight after that shooting accidentally shot himself uh, on 295 and Eastern Avenue around 5.30 this uh, afternoon. Uh, officer Davis uh, was a, David was a 25 year veteran of the MPD, also spent, um, since 2007, on the, he was assigned the Violent Crime Suppression Task Force, where uh, DC police saying he's recovered hundreds of guns throughout his career, and is very well known throughout, of course, uh, the, you know, uh, the department and throughout the district. And this was an active crime scene that uh, Officer David was responding to this afternoon. They found a suspect in a car. They watched this suspect get on to 295 South, drop a gun into a storm drain, and then hop over to the northbound side of 295 commandeer a random motorcycle and then took off and that's when officer David and other team members other officers were able to get there this is an image of the suspect that police are looking for they say that this is the suspect who dropped that gun into the storm drain and when officer David went to retrieve it as part of evidence and in this investigation it's when that gun accidentally went off what we know is that it accidentally shot himself in the upper body and we now have learned that he has died from these injuries. Yeah, D.C. police calling him a true hero, giving his life for the city, for the department, and he will be honored uh, as a line of duty death for the district uh, police department. So just uh, terrible news that passed along today. Officer Wayne David uh, passing away from his injuries after he shot himself accidentally uh, this afternoon. And it is with heavy hearts as we go live to MedStar there in Washington where we have been watching um, officers we do not have those images right now, but we have been watching as officers have been coming in and out of that hospital. We also know that uh, David leaves behind a daughter, a son, a girlfriend, and just many family members, an entire community who are now mourning his death. Yeah, much more on this breaking news here on DC News Now, both on air and also online at dcnewsnow.com.